You may know Adrienne Barbeau from her memorable roles in Maud and horror films, but there's more to this accomplished actress than meets the eye. Behind the scenes, she's made her mark as a talented voice actor for beloved animated characters and even dabbled in music and authorship. Barbeau's love for writing led her to pen two books, while her musical talents were showcased in the stage production of Grease. Contrary to her screen queen image, she has a well-documented dislike for horror movies. From her on-screen roles to her work beyond the screen, Adrienne Barbeau's career is a fascinating journey worth exploring. Stay tuned to learn more about this Hollywood icon. Adrienne Barbeau was born on June 11, 1945, in Sacramento, California, to a comfortable lifestyle provided by her father, Joseph Barbeau, a mobile oil executive. In her teenage years, she developed an interest in the opera, which eventually led her to join a USO tour. This experience introduced her to the thrilling world of entertainment, ultimately causing her to abandon her studies at Foothill College. Driven by her newfound passion, the young Adrian found herself captivated by the energy and excitement of live performances. As she traveled from base to base, performing for tired soldiers who needed a break from their duties, she realized that making people smile and laugh brought her immense joy. Through these experiences, she fell in love with show business, unintentionally setting the stage for a successful career in acting. As time went on, Adrian continued to hone her craft, learning everything she could about the art of storytelling through performance. Her dedication paid off when she began appearing in various films and shows, each one contributing to her growing reputation as a talented actress. With every role, she left her mark on both the screen and the hearts of audiences everywhere. Adrienne Barbeau's Broadway career took flight in the chorus of Fiddler on the Roof, where she later took on the role of Hodel. The actress's enchanting performances captured the hearts of many, leading her to grace the stages of over 25 musicals. One of her most memorable roles was as Rizzo in Greece, which earned her a Theatre World Award and a Tony nomination. Her portrayal of the tough-talking, sassy character resonated with audiences, showcasing her ability to embody diverse and complex characters. Barbeau's contributions to Broadway are not limited to her acting skills alone. Her undeniable talent and dedication to her craft have left an indelible mark on the world of theater. Her performances in various musicals have captivated audiences and inspired aspiring actors alike. Throughout her career, the actress has proven herself to be a versatile performer, taking on various roles that have showcased her range and talent. Her work on Broadway is a testament to her enduring impact on the industry, and her performances continue to be cherished by older adults who remember her classic roles. As Barbeau's career progressed, she never lost sight of her love for Broadway. She continued to perform in various musicals, each time leaving a lasting impression on her audience. Her dedication to her craft and her passion for storytelling have made her a beloved figure in the world of theater. In conclusion, Adrienne Barbeau's Broadway career is a classic example of an actress's undying dedication to her craft. Her performances have left an enduring mark on the industry, inspiring aspiring actors and captivating audiences for generations to come. Adrienne Barbeau's career took an exciting turn when she transitioned from Broadway to television. The actress's breakthrough role came with the groundbreaking sitcom Maud, where she brilliantly portrayed Carol Trainer. This classic show gained widespread recognition for its daring engagement with progressive social issues, such as feminism and women's rights, which marked a significant shift in television content during that time. Maud premiered in 1972 and quickly became a hit, addressing relevant topics that resonated with many viewers. Adrienne's portrayal of Carol, the daughter of the title character, played a crucial role in the show's success. Her ability to bring depth and charm to the character contributed to the show's impact on the television landscape. As the show tackled various subjects, it provided a platform for important conversations and showcased the evolving role of women in society. Adrienne's performance in Maud not only solidified her status as a talented actress, but also demonstrated her commitment to projects that promoted social change. The show's engagement with progressive social issues, combined with Adrienne's captivating performance, made Maud a must-watch television series. This classic sitcom left an indelible mark on television history and paved the way for future shows to explore complex themes and character development. Adrienne Barbeau's transition from Broadway to television was successful thanks to her role in Maud. Her ability to adapt to new mediums and her dedication to tackling relevant social issues have made her a respected figure 
in the entertainment industry. Adrienne Barbeau, an accomplished actress, found herself in an unexpected situation when she took on the role of a spokesperson for the sitcom Maude. The show, while successful, touched on controversial political matters that Adrienne had never confronted publicly before. Maude was known for its daring approach to tackling social and political issues of the time, which made Adrienne's role as its spokesperson particularly challenging. She was required to speak about the show's themes and messages, many of which were outside her comfort zone. Despite the challenges, Adrienne remained committed to her role and the show. She recognized the importance of addressing these issues and the impact that Maude had on its audience. However, it was a learning experience for her, as she had to navigate the complexities of public discourse on controversial topics. Adrienne's experience with Maude highlights the challenges that actors and actresses can face when they become the face of a controversial show. While it may be uncomfortable, it also provides an opportunity to engage in important conversations and contribute to societal change. Through her role in Maude, Adrienne Barbeau left a lasting impact on television and the cultural landscape of the 1970s. Adrienne Barbeau's career as an actress is most notably marked by her status as a Hollywood sex symbol a title she earned thanks to a popular cheesecake poster in 1978. Despite this image, Barbeau aspired to be involved in more substantial and impactful projects. Barbeau's marriage to filmmaker John Carpenter in 1979 marked the beginning of a successful professional collaboration. Their partnership began on the set of Someone's Watching Me in 1978, where they first met. The actress's first theatrical film appearance was in Carpenter's The Fog, which was released in 1980. Barbeau's career took off in the late 1970s, and she quickly became a household name. Her work in television, film, and theater demonstrated her versatility and talent. However, it was her role as the sultry lead in The Fog that cemented her status as a sex symbol. Despite this image, Barbeau was determined to be taken seriously as an actress. She actively sought out roles in more meaningful projects and worked tirelessly to hone her craft. Her hard work paid off, and she went on to have a successful career in both film and television. Barbeau's marriage to Carpenter was not only a personal success, but also a professional one. Together, they collaborated on several successful films, including Escape from New York and The Thing. Their partnership was built on mutual respect and admiration, and they continued to work together long after their divorce in 1984. In conclusion, Adrienne Barbeau's career as an actress was marked by her status as a Hollywood sex symbol but she was determined to be involved in more meaningful projects. Her marriage to John Carpenter marked the beginning of a successful professional collaboration, and together they created several classic films. Despite the challenges she faced, Barbeau persevered and built a lasting legacy in the world of entertainment. Adrienne Barbeau's career has been marked by her versatility and willingness to explore new creative avenues. The actress, known for her roles in Maude and The Fog, has also showcased her singing ability, releasing an album in 1986. But Barbeau's talents don't stop at acting and singing. She has also ventured into writing, authoring several books, and bringing her unique life experiences into her storytelling. One particularly inspiring aspect of Barbeau's personal life is her journey into motherhood later in life. She had her first child with her first husband, but it was her second marriage to Billy Vanzant that led to an unexpected surprise. At the age of 51, Barbo gave birth to twin boys, a rare and remarkable feat. Despite the challenges that come with raising young children later in life, Barbo has embraced her role as a mother with grace and determination. Her experience has no doubt added even more depth and richness to her already impressive career. Throughout her life and career, Barbo has proven herself to be a force to be reckoned with constantly pushing boundaries and exploring new creative outlets. Her story is a testament to the power of perseverance and the enduring allure of a life lived in pursuit of one's passions. Adrienne Barbeau's writing career took off following a writing class, which led to the creation of her memoir, There Are Worse Things I Could Do. In this book, she shares amusing and captivating stories from her time in the entertainment industry and her personal life. The actress has always been active in diversifying her career. Over the years, she has taken on roles in various television shows, showcasing her versatility and adaptability. More recently, Adrienne Barbeau has lent her voice to video game characters, including in popular titles like God of War 3 and Halo 4. Her involvement in the gaming world has allowed her to reach new audiences and explore different creative avenues. In addition to television and video games, Barbeau has participated in audio series, 
further demonstrating her enduring presence in the entertainment industry. Her ability to adapt to new formats and platforms is a testament to her lasting impact on the world of entertainment. Delving into writing and expanding her repertoire into voice acting and audio series, Adrienne Barbeau continues to captivate audiences with her talent and dedication. This classic actress's career remains vibrant and dynamic, resonating with fans across generations. In the world of entertainment, Adrienne Barbeau has made a name for herself as a talented actress, singer, and author. Born on June 11, 1945, in Sacramento, California, Barbeau began her career on the stage before transitioning to television and film. She is perhaps best known for her role as Carol Trainer, the daughter of Maude Finley, in the groundbreaking 1970s sitcom Maude. Her performance earned her a Golden Globe nomination and solidified her status as a rising star. Barbeau continued to make her mark in the industry with memorable roles in horror classics such as The Fog and Creepshow, as well as comedies like Back to School and Cannonball Run. She also lent her voice to the iconic character Catwoman in the animated series Batman the Animated Series. In addition to her work in front of the camera, Barbeau has also authored several books, including a memoir and a series of novels. She has continued to act in various stage productions and has even returned to television in recent years with recurring roles in shows like Dexter and General Hospital. Throughout her career, Adrienne Barbeau has proven herself to be a versatile and enduring talent in the entertainment industry. Her contributions continue to resonate with audiences today, and she is truly a captivating figure in the tapestry of Hollywood history. Adrienne Barbeau, born on June 11, 1945, in Sacramento, California, had a unique upbringing that influenced her career in acting. Her mother, an amateur actress, and her father, a public relations executive, nurtured her love for the arts. Adrienne often accompanied her mother to community theater productions, where she developed an early appreciation for the stage. During her high school years, Adrienne discovered a passion for music and joined the school choir. She also developed an interest in journalism and worked on the school newspaper. However, it was her involvement in school plays that truly captivated her. She excelled in various roles, further fueling her desire to pursue acting. After high school, Adrienne moved to New York City to study acting at the famed Actors Studio. There, she met influential figures such as Lee Strasberg, who became her mentor. Strasberg's teachings on method, acting helped shape Adrienne's approach to her craft. Adrienne's career took off in the 1970s when she landed a role in the Broadway production of Grease. Her performance caught the attention of director John Carpenter, who later cast her in the cult classic film The Fog. Throughout her career, Adrienne has worked with notable directors and actors, continually refining her skills and contributing to the world of entertainment. In addition to her work in film and theater, Adrienne has also made a name for herself in television, lending her talents to various series and made-for-TV movies. Her ability to adapt to different mediums and genres is a testament to her versatility as an actress. Adrienne Barbeau's success can be traced back to her upbringing, early exposure to the arts, and the mentors she met along the way. Her passion for acting and her commitment to her craft continue to inspire aspiring actors and entertain audiences worldwide. Growing up in a small town in Pennsylvania, Adrienne Barbeau was always drawn to the stage. She loved watching her mother perform in local theater productions and would often join in on the fun. At the age of nine, she landed her first role in a community theater production of Annie Get Your Gun. From that point forward, she knew she wanted to become an actress. During high school, Adrienne continued to hone her craft by participating in drama club and taking part in various school plays. After graduation, she moved to New York City to study acting at the prestigious American Academy of Dramatic Arts. Adrienne's big break came in 1978 when she was cast as Rizzo in the original Broadway production of Grease. Her performance earned her rave reviews and caught the attention of Hollywood producers. Soon after, she made her film debut in John Carpenter's horror classic The Fog and went on to star in numerous TV shows and movies throughout the 80s and 90s. Throughout her illustrious career, Adrienne has remained passionate about her craft. In interviews, she often speaks about how much she loves bringing characters to life and connecting with audiences through storytelling. Even today, at the age of 75, she continues to act and inspire aspiring actors around the world. Adrienne Barbeau, born on June 11, 1945, in Sacramento, California, faced numerous challenges in her early acting career. Financial struggles were a constant companion for Barbeau. To make ends meet, she worked as a go-go dancer, 
and a singing waitress before finding success in acting. Industry skepticism was another hurdle Barbeau had to overcome. Despite her undeniable talent, she often faced rejection due to her unconventional looks. However, Barbeau refused to let these setbacks deter her. She honed her craft, taking acting classes and performing in local theater productions. Barbeau's resilience paid off when she landed the role of Rizzo in the original Broadway production of Grease in 1972. This breakthrough role not only provided financial stability, but also garnered her critical acclaim. In the world of television, Barbeau faced further challenges. She was often typecast in stereotypical roles, but she refused to be pigeonholed. Barbeau took control of her career by producing and starring in her own television series, Mod's House, in 1986. Barbeau's determination and creativity enabled her to overcome early obstacles and build a successful and enduring career. Her legacy as a trailblazing actress continues to inspire aspiring actors today. Adrienne Barbeau's career took a significant turn in the late 1970s when she starred in the groundbreaking television series Maud. Her portrayal of a divorced, independent woman resonated with audiences and helped challenge traditional stereotypes. Barbeau's performance was praised by critics and peers alike, with many noting her ability to bring depth and nuance to her character. In 1980, Barbeau's career reached new heights with her role in the horror classic The Fog. Her performance as a radio disc jockey who becomes embroiled in a supernatural mystery cemented her status as a screen queen and showcased her versatility as an actress. Barbeau's work in the 1980s and 1990s continued to garner critical acclaim. She starred in a number of successful television shows, including Carmen and Swamp Thing, and earned praise for her work in the theater. Her performance in the Broadway production of Grease was particularly noteworthy, with many critics praising her energy and charisma. Throughout her career, Barbeau has been recognized for her contributions to the entertainment industry. She has received numerous awards and accolades, including a Saturn Award for Best Actress and a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. Despite these achievements, Barbeau remains humble and dedicated to her craft. In recent years, Barbeau has continued to work in film, television, and theater. Her performances are as captivating as ever, and she shows no signs of slowing down. With her talent, versatility, and dedication, Adrienne Barbeau has left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. Adrienne Barbeau's artistic vision is deeply rooted in her personal experiences and worldview. As an accomplished actress, she has brought to life a variety of complex characters, each reflecting her unique style and approach. Barbeau's career spans over four decades, during which she has demonstrated her versatility in film, television, and theater. She began her career on Broadway, where she starred in the original production of Grease, and later went on to appear in numerous horror and science fiction films. Barbeau's approach to acting is grounded in her belief that characters must be relatable and authentic. She once stated, I want to play characters who are real, who have depth and complexity. This is evident in her portrayal of strong, independent women who challenge societal norms and expectations. One of Barbeau's most iconic roles is that of Stevie Wayne in the horror classic The Fog. As a single mother and radio DJ, Stevie Wayne is a complex character who must confront her fears to protect her son and community. Barbeau's nuanced performance brings depth and authenticity to the role, making Stevie Wayne a memorable and enduring character. Barbeau's personal experiences have also influenced her work. As a survivor of domestic abuse, she has used her platform to raise awareness and advocate for victims. In her one-woman show Carmelina, a one-woman musical, she portrays a woman who escapes an abusive relationship and reclaims her life. The show is a powerful testament to Barbeau's resilience and advocacy. In addition to her acting career, Barbeau is also an accomplished author. Her memoir, There Are Worse Things I Could Do, explores her life and career, offering a candid and introspective look at her experiences in Hollywood. Her fiction works, including Vampires of Hollywood and Love Bites, showcase her wit and humor, adding another dimension to her creative output. Throughout her career, Adrienne Barbeau has remained committed to her artistic vision and process. Her unique style and approach, grounded in authenticity and complexity, have left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. Her work continues to resonate with audiences, inspiring and empowering them to confront their fears and embrace their own unique experiences. Adrienne Barbeau's impact and influence on the acting industry are undeniable. With a career spanning over five decades, she has left her mark in various fields, including film, television, and theater. 
Her versatility is evident through the diverse range of roles she has played throughout her career. Barbeau started her career on Broadway, but gained fame after starring in John Carpenter's horror classic The Fog. This role paved the way for more opportunities in Hollywood, where she became known for her strong female characters who defied stereotypes. Her work in the genre of horror has had a lasting influence. As stated by director Mick Garris, Adrienne was one of the first screen queens she brought intelligence, depth, and humanity to every character she played. Her ability to balance fear with vulnerability made audiences connect with her characters on a deeper level, setting new standards for actresses in the horror genre. In addition to horror, Barbeau also made significant contributions to comedy and drama genres. For instance, her performance as Carol Ruth Kane in Maud, a groundbreaking sitcom about feminism and social issues, showcases her comedic timing and dramatic prowess. Barbeau's impact extends beyond just acting. She is an advocate for women's rights and often uses her platform to raise awareness about gender inequality both in Hollywood and society at large. According to actress Jamie Lee Curtis, Adrian has always been a trailblazer, advocating for equal pay and treatment for women in the entertainment industry. Moreover, Barbo serves as a source of inspiration for aspiring actors. Actor and producer Seth Green once shared, seeing Adrian's success gave me hope that I could carve out my own path in this business. She proved you don't need to fit into a mold to succeed. Overall, Adrian Barbo's contributions to the acting industry are substantial. From breaking barriers in horror to championing women's rights, her influence continues to resonate today. Adrienne Barbeau, an accomplished actress, is also known for her interests and values outside of the entertainment industry. She's an animal lover and has been a vegetarian for over four decades. This commitment to animal welfare often influences her work, as she's been known to advocate for animal rights in her roles and public appearances. Barbeau is also passionate about women's health issues. She's been open about her own experiences with breast cancer and has used her platform to raise awareness and funds for research. In 2010, she even wrote a book, There Are Worse Things I Could Do, which includes a chapter on her cancer journey. Philanthropy plays a significant role in Barbeau's life. She's involved with various charities, including the American Cancer Society and the Red Cross. In addition, she's a strong supporter of the arts and has donated her time and resources to arts education programs. Her personal values of compassion, resilience, and creativity are evident in both her professional and personal life. Whether she's on stage, on screen, or supporting a cause she believes in, Adrienne Barbeau continues to make a positive impact on those around her. Adrienne Barbeau, an accomplished actress, has left an indelible mark in the industry. With a career spanning decades, she has shown her versatility in various roles, from film to television, and even Broadway. Her work in Maude, and Creepshow is still remembered and appreciated today. When asked about her future contributions, Adrian might express her excitement for new opportunities and her intention to continue exploring different characters and stories. She might also emphasize the importance of staying true to oneself and one's values no matter what challenges come along. As for aspiring professionals, Adrian would likely offer valuable advice. She might encourage them to be persistent, to keep learning and growing, and to always be open to new experiences. She might also remind them to take care of themselves, both physically and mentally, as the industry can be demanding. In the end, Adrienne Barbeau's legacy is not just about her impressive body of work, but also about her positive attitude, her resilience, and her dedication to her craft. Her contributions will continue to resonate with audiences for years to come. Adrienne Barbeau's journey in the entertainment industry is a testament to her passion and innovation. Beginning her career on Broadway, she quickly transitioned to television, starring in the groundbreaking series Maud. Barbeau's career then took an innovative turn when she became the screen queen of horror films in the 1980s, with notable roles in The Fog and Creepshow. Throughout her career, Barbeau has continued to push boundaries and challenge herself, appearing in various television shows, films, and stage productions. She has even lent her voice to animated series and video games. Barbeau's enduring impact on the entertainment industry is undeniable, having inspired generations of actors and actresses. One of Barbeau's most significant contributions to the industry is her advocacy for women's roles and representation. She has consistently chosen complex and dynamic characters, refusing to be limited by stereotypes. Her work has helped to pave the way for future generations of actresses. In addition to her acting career, Barbeau is also an accomplished author, having written several books, including memoirs and novels. 
Her writing is yet another example of her creativity and innovation. Adrienne Barbeau's journey is a powerful reminder of the power of creativity and perseverance. Her ability to adapt and innovate throughout her career, as well as her unwavering passion for her craft, has left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. Her story serves as inspiration for aspiring actors and actresses, as well as anyone looking to pursue their passions. Adrienne Barbeau, an accomplished actress, has left an indelible mark in the entertainment industry. With a career spanning over five decades, she has taken on a variety of roles that have showcased her versatility and talent. Barbeau began her career on the stage, appearing in numerous Broadway productions such as Grease and Fiddler on the Roof. In the late 1970s, she transitioned to television, landing a starring role in the hit series Maud. Her portrayal of Carol Trainer earned her a Golden Globe nomination and solidified her status as a household name. In the 1980s, Barbeau turned her attention to film, appearing in a number of horror and science fiction classics such as The Fog, Escape from New York, and Swamp Thing. Her work in these films helped to establish her as a scream queen and cemented her place in movie history. Throughout her career, Barbeau has continued to return to the stage, earning critical acclaim for her performances in productions such as Women Behind Bars and The Rocky Horror Show. She has also lent her voice to a number of animated series and video games, including Batman the Animated Series and Cars 2. Despite the many roles she has played, Barbeau has remained true to herself and her craft. She has always been willing to take on new challenges and push herself as an actress. Her dedication and talent have earned her a place among the greats of the entertainment industry. As we reflect on Adrienne Barbeau's work and legacy, we are reminded of the power of perseverance and the importance of staying true to oneself. Her career is a testament to the fact that with hard work and determination, anyone can achieve their dreams. So, let us take a moment to celebrate this remarkable actress and all that she has accomplished. Share your thoughts on Adrienne Barbeau's work and legacy in the comments. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more content celebrating the creative spirits shaping energy.